Hello to all my viewers. Today we are going to discuss what is a column resorter in NIME. So for this, we will go in the environment of NIME. I will import one uh, data set which is in Excel format. So for this, first of all, I will have to, have to activate input output. So IO. In this, I will activate Excel Reader. A node will appear. When I double click on it, it will give me an option to browse my data set which is in Excel format. Now I will connect the customer churn data, apply, click OK. I'll right click on it and execute it. So whenever any node turns green, you are in the position to extract the output from it. So again, I'll right click on it and I'll see the file table. You can see uh, that the chronology of the variable is row ID, gender, age, payment, churn and last transaction. Now, if I want to change this chronology, if I want to keep some variables ahead or in the last, I can do with the help of column resorter. I'll double click on it and the node will get connected with the Excel reader node. I'll right click on it and press configure. Now, whatever chronology which I want to set, I can set from here. Say for example, I want the gender to be at the last. So I'll press it down. I can arrange it according to A to Z or Z to A. I'll press apply, click OK and then execute. Now, let us see the output data. You can see that the gender has moved to the last position. So this is the way a column disorder works in NIME. For more videos on NIME, kindly subscribe to my channel. You can follow me on LinkedIn and Twitter. Please refer my playlist in which I have already uploaded many videos on NIME. Please don't forget to subscribe the channel.